Hi, my name is Travis Gritter, and in this video tutorial series, we're going to be exploring the fascinating subject of quantum computing. Now, quantum computing has a number of different topics in it that can be a bit counterintuitive, a little bit difficult to understand. But by using a quantum simulator, and by looking at a little bit of the math behind quantum computing, I'm hoping to give you a bit of a better understanding of exactly how quantum computing works. Now to do this, I have a number of different sections which I'll be going over. I'm going to start by talking about the qubit, the most fundamental unit of measurement within quantum computing. I'm then going to talk about quantum gates and how we apply uh, operations on these qubits. I'm then going to explore a couple of the classical algorithms within quantum computing. I'm then going to take a look at the differences uh, between quantum simulators, which is what I'll be using, and an actual quantum computer, some of the benefits and disadvantages of both. And finally, I'm going to be talking about my favorite subject, which is the universal quantum computer. I hope you enjoy this video series. Uh, it's a very interesting subject, quantum computing, and by the end of it, I hope you see just the potential that quantum computing can have on the world. 